The first major federal gun safety bill is broken through a filibuster in the Senate. The Senate voted 65 to 34 to break the filibuster, and the bill could soon see final passage. The bill includes millions of dollars for mental health, school safety, and crisis intervention programs. It would also offer incentives to states who add juvenile records to national background checks. Other measures include guidelines for anyone between 18 and 21 looking to buy a gun and keeping domestic violent abusers away from firearms. Missouri senators have two different views on this bill. Senator Roy Blunt was one of the 10 senators who helped put this bill together. Senator Josh Hawley, on the other hand, has been a vocal opponent of the bill. We talked to Hawley today. He says he will be a solid no vote on this bill. He feels the bill doesn't do anything to create harsher penalties for those who commit crimes that involve guns. Hawley outlined what kind of bill he would like to see. I mean, what we should have is a crime bill that goes after criminals and makes kids in schools and neighborhoods and churches safer. This does not do that. Now, I think it does contain some money for school security funding, which is good. I mean, so, you know, that, I mean, that, I suppose, is, is something. I'm not sure how it's going to be apportioned, though. We also reached out to the NRA, Missouri Democratic Party, and the Missouri Fraternal Order of Police about the bill, and we haven't gotten a comment yet.